Hi, this is Monique Guile, the Business Intuitive. So today I want to talk about expansion, growth, creating a new reality, and seemingly chaos. So right now, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm in the process of writing a book, my first book. And I had no idea it was going to be what it is. I mean, it's a lot of work. It's a lot of detail. It's a lot of focus. It's a lot of um, editing a lot, a lot, a lot of editing. I mean, it's just like you edit and you edit and you re-edit. But anyway, thank God I've got a great team to help me with that. But the main thing is, is when you're creating a new reality, like right now, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm in the process of creating this new reality. And when we, when we create a new reality, we are literally focusing on a future that's not there yet. And we're bringing that future, so to speak, to our now situation. And a lot of times when people are creating new realities, most of the time, including myself right now, um, there may be some chaos, there may be some drama, there may be some things that go on in your situation, your personal life, that are seemingly falling apart. And what happens is, is that, excuse me, I have a little cold right now. What happens is, is that um, when you're creating this new reality, the old reality has to dissolve. The old reality, the atoms are discoagulating, if you will. And, this, you know, a lot of people get freaked out. They get scared. They think, oh, my God, you know, all this crazy stuff. I'll speak for my own life right now. So right now I'm dealing with, I got a notice that my mom's place, she, I take care of my mom. She has dementia and she's in a facility. And I got this sudden letter that something suddenly is going on there that's not so good. So that happened. Um, I've got a little health issue I'm dealing with. Um, there's some mechanical problems with some mechanical equipment. Um, there's a bunch of things going on in my personal life right now. But I know enough to know that it's just my old reality dissolving. And I have to stay more focused, more diligent, more concentrated on the reality what I'm stepping into. Because my book has a whole life of its own. It has people that are frequency specific to the reality I'm stepping into. Atomically, it's going to attract in people, places, things, situations that are of that future self. And so I have a, a vision board, <coughs> excuse me, a vision board where um, it's right near my desk. I see it every day and I keep myself focused on where I'm heading, what I'm doing, what I'm creating. Because right now it's it can be a little scary because for me, creating this book, I have no idea. When you're creating something totally new, you don't know if it's going to work or not. You don't know if, um, I mean, I don't know. I have no idea. All I know is I'm putting my information, my workshop information into book forms so people can take themselves through the workshop on their own. And I hope it helps. I hope, I hope it helps someone. But I have no idea what's going to happen. I, I have no clue. And that can be really scary. And that's why so many people stay safe. And also, too, in the midst of creating something new, again, things fall away, things change, and it looks scary. And a lot of people will revert back to what they know and they'll stop in the middle of their creation. But this is the time more than ever to stay focused, don't quit, don't quit no matter what, keep going, keep moving forward, keep doing what you're doing, and meditate, and pray, and breathe, and walk, and have loving people around you, and support. And uh, let me know how you do. Let me know what's going on with you. I appreciate people's feedback. I really do. And um, I'll tune in again soon. And I look forward to speaking with you again soon. Happy creating.